Okay, guys, we're going to make uh, a cabbage and carrot rice. So the first thing we're going to do is cook our rice. I'm using basmati rice. So I've already washed it. I'm going to put a little bit of ghee here because we want to add that extra flavor. I'm going to toast my rice grains. Now I've grated some turmeric here. So what we're going to do now is toast our rice grains. And because of the grated turmeric, you will notice that the rice grains are going to get yellow. Um, so this is two cups of rice that I have here. Now the ratio is usually one cup of rice to two cups of water. However, I always put a little less water when I'm cooking my rice. Okay, so after we toast our rice grains, I'm gonna add the water and then I'm gonna allow it, I'll put a little bit of season my rice a little. So I'll put some um, seasoning in it and then we will, after it comes up to a boil, turn it down cover it and allow it to cook, leave it to cook for eight minutes and then we will turn off the fire and I will just leave it for a further five minutes on um, covered, sorry, okay? So that's what we're going to do in order to cook our rice. You see how nice and yellow this is getting and that's because of the turmeric that I grated on the rice. So this is gonna take some time, guys. So let me come back. Um, so I'm just gonna fry up these rice grains for a few minutes and then I'll be. Okay, guys, so I've been frying my rice grains now for a few minutes. So at this point in time, I'm gonna add in my water. Add a little bit of seasoning to my rice. So I'm going to add some Mrs. Dash garlic and herbs, seasoning blend to it. I'm also going to add some salt to it as well. If you want, you could add whatever other seasonings. Um, to your rice, um, you can add all-purpose seasoning if you want, you can add chicken bouillon powder if you want, whatever seasoning you want to add to your rice, you can do that. All right, so we're going to allow this to come up to a boil and then we're going to cover and turn our fire down to low and leave it to cook for eight minutes. Okay, so we're gonna cover this now and turn down our fire to low. Okay, so I'm gonna add in now the garlic. To this now I'm going to add in the cabbage, carrots, about four seasoning peppers and some currants. Right, I'm going to add a little bit of salt to this. Well, I'm just going to fry this up for a bit and I'll be back. Okay, at this point I'm going to add in my cooked rice. Mm. 
Right. I'm going to add a little bit of um, raw cane sugar to this to balance off the savory with the sweet. I'm also going to sprinkle some tamari soy sauce. That's a gluten-free soy sauce. It's not very salty. I'm going to add some sesame oil as well to it. So I'm going to add a little bit of this sesame oil. And then we're going to top with some um, 